Hello, CPRS moderators. Um, this is going to be a quick instruction on how to change your board of directors page. So, starting from your home page, go to the board of directors page. And we're going to start with District 2 here. To edit the page, simply click up at the top right, edit this page. And here we are at the um, editor. So you've got our community tabs box. This relates to the same box that's here, or tabs that are here. Please don't play with these at all because if you play with those, you're only going to change them on this page, not your entire website. And um, this HTML box here refers to this little line. And oops, the third box down below, this is um, a three column well, which was actually this one. And each well is uh, designed to have your content in there. So if we're going to work with the very first box. We have Katie Koss. And you, uh, up in the right hand column here, you got name and title. This information is the same thing that appears in the blue box here. To edit this first one, go ahead and click here in the uh, edit box. And now you've got a WYSIWYG editor. So with Katie's picture and her information down here. This information is what appears when you mouse over the top. Okay, so let's say you want to now um, create uh, your vice president and your um, president-elect, your secretary, treasurer, and so forth. The easiest way to, to do this is actually to copy the content. So I'm going to take this first box here and I'm going to click on this plus sign that says copy to clipboard. And up in the right hand up here, we've got an extra box. This is actually the same images and everything that appears down below. Click and drag and bring it into this box. And now we have a duplicate. So let's just say that I am the CPRS V2 vice president. And change that to my name. And so this little BR code here is actually what makes the return happen in two different lines there. And the CSS code, um, this is what actually makes that blue box float up and down. It controls the size of it and everything else. So you don't need to play with that part of it. I'm going to go ahead and click on Save. And so now I've got um, this information here. You can see it's got my name there. Now I want to go ahead and edit this information down below and change my picture. So to change the picture, just click on here. Go to Insert Edit. Um, and then you're going to go search for the picture. Districts and sections have their own... Um, graphics library area and so it's very very oh maybe it's not there okay so now to add a photo or we're actually replace Katie's photo you're going to click on the image click up here insert image go source and we actually already have a, a folder of all of many of the district and section leaders uh, you can go ahead and add the first the pictures here if you want or if you need to go locate them there you can as well um, and then just for fun, uh, I'm going to take Adam's picture and bring it in there for me. Um, he will not be saving this for too much, so let me bring that in here. 